Hello everyone, I hope you had a wonderful weekend. Uh, this is a reading for Monday, August um, 5th. Okay, August 5th. We're in August. Happy birthday to all the uh, August babies out there. Alright, here's a general reading. Today's reading is going to be a little bit different because we're going to be uh, discussing um, briefly, very briefly, wishes. So if you have a wish in mind, there's something you desire, there's a wish going on and, um, you know, this is something to consider this spread for today. This is a general reading. I'm not going to use a significator, otherwise I'm going to have 16 significators on here for the obvious reason. Okay, so general reading. If you want a personal one, you can contact me and we can chat about personal readings. Okay, here we go. I'm going to start pulling cards here. So what is surrounding you, a certain situation? Okay. Uh, so regarding wishes, we're pulling, we've pulled the Ace of Swords upside down. We have the Knight of Wands right side up and the King of Wands right side up. Okay. So what do, uh, the situation, your wish, okay. Um, you're lacking original thought. Sorry, but that's what's going on. Um, there's a lack of originality with um, the situation um, regarding your wish. If you want your wish to materialize, you're going to have to be a little bit more, re uh, you have to be original. Do something different, be original. Um, because people can see through what's not original, they can see when you're copying, you, they can see when, or it's like if I'm, I'm reading a story, you know, if I read The Lord of the Rings and then someone comes and writes something very much like The Lord of the Rings, I'm like, well, this is a knockoff, right? So that kind of thing. Original thought um, has to be authentic if um, that's what's surrounding um, the situation in you regarding your wish coming true with the uh, with the knight the knight of wands um, you have to be able to be adventurous adventurous okay um, and with the king of cups you you have to devote yourself so because the king of cups is about devotion and emotions and it, and it, uh, in a very mature uh, grounded manner so you have to be willing to be adventurous like really go out there and really uh, um, keep your eyes on the prize and really head out there to get what you want. You really have to work towards. You have to work for it, okay? It doesn't come easy. Things don't come easy, all right? Things don't come overnight. They don't happen overnight, okay? So that's the situation that's surrounding you. And um, the advice here with the King of Cups again, um, be emotionally under control and be devoted. Just be devoted to your cause and, and be original, okay? Because no one wants to... It's like, you know, you publishing a book. It's like, for instance, you know, uh, I publish a book, and but yet someone wrote about the same thing in a blog a year ago, and then now I'm publishing a book about the things that I read in someone else's blog, and I don't even give them credit. That kind of thing. Okay, factors describing your wish. Four. Five. Huh. Yep, okay. So we have got uh, factors surrounding the wish here. Um... There's a sense of walking away or moving away from something with the Eight of Cups. Uh, abandoning post, aban you know, abandoning ship, abandoning ship, abandoning post, or moving to higher ground. So this is a, this is a factor involving your wish. You want to make it happen, but with this lack of originality, you're going to have to move away from whatever it is that you're doing in order to find a new path, a new course. There's a lot of competition, okay? Again, factors describing your wish. You want, you wish to do something, but there's a lot of competition in the field or whatever it is that you're um, wanting to accomplish, okay? So you're gonna have to, really, you have to be really strong, really strong to fight the competition right now if you're, if you continue on the path that you're, that you're headed on. Um, and then you have the 10 of, the 10 of koi, coins upside down so there's definitely not much legacy like you're not well known or your name is not out there uh, but you know everyone starts somewhere right everyone begins somewhere okay so there's a sense there's an issue with legacy an issue with legacy okay now um, what opposes you I'm gonna put these opposing cards over here seven oh, oh eight nine boy oh boy Okay, opposing you is, well, a major problem with this spread is that if in position 7, 8, and 9, this is a wish spread. Um, if this, this is the wish card. The 9 of cups is the wish card. And if this card, this is the wish, 
right? And it's right side up. That's good, but it happens to fall into the opposing stack here. Um, and so that's a big uh, indicator of a pro. I don't want to say a problem, but it's a major influence in your wish not materializing at this moment. Okay, there's the Ten of Cups. There's happiness, happiness, and a new start. Happiness, friendship, networking. Um, with the with the page with the page of cups, it's like you. This is a dreamy person, dreamy, romantic, creative individual. So what I'm seeing is a wish that leads to extra, uh, happiness, but it's sort of a fantasy right now. This is a fantasy, like you're dreamy, you're dreaming about it. It's a romanticized ideal at the moment. Romanticized, okay. Um, actions to take, things to look out for. Actions to take, things to look out for. Okay, okay, so now we have two eights here. So very important because eight is about movement, infinity, that kind of thing. Eight is um, definitely it's just movement, okay? Um, and there's a lot of action that needs to happen here. So in the pile of action and things to look out for, um, there's a lot of work. You need to work on details, um, hashing out your plan, working on whatever it is you're doing to make that, to fulfill that wish, um, okay? Fulfill that wish in a practical matter. Approach it differently. Um, and also there's a sense of mentally, uh, uh, like you're mentally ang anguished at the moment. Like, But the thing is, you're blocking yourself. So this is telling me that um, look out for, uh, for uh, when you start having ideas where, oh, I can't do this. I can't get out of the situation. I don't know what to do. That's something to look out for. Okay, so look out for that. If you don't look out for that, you're just going to, you know, you're just going to literally break your own heart. Okay, this is tears. This is uh, crying, heartache, and possible depression. Okay, what I'm seeing here, things to look out for, um, is uh, work hard to avoid a depressive state. You need to work hard, work, work as hard as you can, okay, toward obtaining your goal and avoiding the state of depression. Okay, and then the outcome here, we have a Ace of Cups, a King of Wands, um, and then we have, uh, oh, this is the um, one, two, three, yeah, the six, right, the six of coins. Um, so what what do we have here? Uh, outcome, Ace of Cups, this is a uh, this is a, a very positive card. I mean, I, I see this as spirit descending, okay, descending into the cup. Um, message from God, new, new fruitful beginning, emotional well-being, okay. So um, for outcome, for your, you know, the outcome is you, you need to, you need to approach what is going on here, especially the opposing forces in order for you to be emotionally well, uh, emotionally well okay, emotionally well. Um, there need, there, with the with the king of wands, okay, this is fire, fire, um, you need to have a, you need to make changes that will be vital, make changes that will be vital, okay, um, because if you don't make these changes, you're not going to have the support. This is the six of coins. This is the, I always I, I say this is like charity, you know, charity, um, giving, uh, giving um, for, from a place of the heart. And what this is telling me is that um, there's the, the, what's going on here with your wish. There's been a level of like take, 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 but not giving. So if you're wanting to attract something, you have to give it as well. So if you want love, you have to give love. If you want um, money, you have to give money. I'm not saying you have to give $100, but there has to be a level of charity of, you know, that kind of, um, those actions that tell the universe, okay, she's in, she's well, or he, she is well balanced, okay? Now, overall, looking at the cards, um, let me see, let's look at the reverse cards. We have one, two um three so three out of the 15 cards are reverse that's not a bad thing that's a good thing which tells me though you have um in the opposing stack the 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 wish upright this is telling me 
you can materialize your wish but it will not be in the manner that you are originally thinking so again going back to original thought and moving away with the eight of cups moving away from something changing changing all right um changing the way we're working okay changing the way we're working on whatever it is that you're wanting to materialize with your wish and avoiding um the state of depression why because uh, this wish card is in the opposing stack so this is telling me um that well it's not your wish you want it to materialize in a specific way at a specific time okay um with specific elements okay but it's not gonna work out that way okay so understand that now and let's move on with that this okay so i'm going to end this reading it's been pretty long just want to do something different uh and you know i'll pull one card from from the oracle just to give us one little piece of advice here um something different right let's see let's pull that card and this, what will this card say this card says cosmos look at that be cre creativity and vastness so again we're going to the beginning of the deck where we're talking about being original okay because if you're not original if you're copying and doing the same thing as someone else for crying out loud um it, it, you know you're not going to get anywhere okay so be creative dig in there dig in your mind dig your own brain okay like be innovative be creative okay and um uh so that you're able to uh, uh materialize and realize your dreams your wish okay may this mess message reach you with good health blessings and abundance always and i will see you tomorrow on tuesday bye